Away from the chaos and tension of the big city, you can take a break from the burdens of work and life. Even if only for a few days, we are longing for a place where we can breathe freely and become truly relaxed. I've been to many places around the world and this is not a long journey, but when I arrived, I became refreshed and was suddenly at peace. This is Penglai, a dreamland on Earth. Penglai Water City was one of the four major commercial ports in ancient China, and it was also one of the most important and strategic military ports used against foreign enemies. You can imagine how spectacular and bustling the port was. Thousands of boats coming in and out during the day, or numerous lights lit up the dark sky at night. Thousands of boats and hundreds of barges vying for space in this glorious place. At the ancient boat museum, we discovered the history of the area and witnessed its evolving existence. Now we're going to enter this mysterious dreamland. This is the Penglai Pavilion, one of the four most famous pavilions in China, together with the Huanghe Tower, Yueyang Tower and Tenwang Pavilion. Among the four famous pavilions, three are located in the southern part of China. Penglai Pavilion is the only one in the north. Situated on a coastal mountain, Danya, it has endured thousands of years of wind and rain erosion, but still maintains its original majestic and towering appearance. The Mysterious Mirages, stories of seeking immortality by Emperor Jing Shu Huang and Wu Di of the Han Dynasty, and the legend of the eight immortals crossing the sea, all add to the mystery. We can see the Honghai and Bohai seas converging at the foot of Tianhang Mountain. This is the division line of the two bodies of water. An ancient tale states that a day in heaven is equal to one year on earth. At Penglai Pavilion, time seems to stand still. We are surrounded by beautiful scenes from the past, like the pavilion, temples, roads and trees, and also the legendary stories behind them. Walking in Penglai Pavilion, I feel like looking off far into the distance, seeking a mysterious mountain on the sea like the ancients once did. I can't be satisfied by just imagining and dreaming. I want to experience this true happiness. Come on, let's fly like the immortals to the sea! I love animals. I've seen many beautiful horses around the world, but these horses are different. Look at this one. It's an Oldenburg, warm-blooded horse from Germany. A very precious breed. It was a show jumping champion in Germany when it was four. It is worth five million euros. A table of homemade dishes symbolises happiness in life and triggers deep feelings of nostalgia. If you want leisure time and to visit amazing sights, food is always an important theme. At Penglai you can witness the simple life of a fisherman or experience agritainment in the mountain. Local people use the simplest materials to make homemade dishes. Everyone is really enjoying their food. In Penglai I see many smiling faces. Other people's happiness also makes me happy. A journey teaches you the value of sharing and cherishing the simple things in life. We will live our lives elegantly and harmoniously if we all have a peaceful heart. Sanshin Mountain combines the majesty of imperial palaces in the north and the delicacy of gardens in the region south of the Yangtze River. Penglai can bring many people many pleasures, both ancient and modern, both eastern and western. Now I'm leaving the traditional eastern region for the lovely European-style countryside. Many people may not know that besides being the hometown of eastern immortals, Penglai is also a land that is blessed by the god of wine. Nearly 100 companies have established businesses here, and each different chateau has its own characteristics and merits, and all are deserving of a visit. 
Penglai has so many chateaus because it's one of the world's top seven coastal grape planting areas. And if you want to visit these golden wine coasts, Penglai is the only one in Asia. Surrounded by tasty wines and scenic views, in the absence of chaos or noise, isn't this the life of the immortals? Through a sip of the delicious wine, you can feel the best wishes that Penglai sends to you. As a blessed place, Penglai shares its blessing with visitors. Just like them, become a perfect couple for love and for Penglai. I'm moved by their joyous moments and feel their happiness. I'm going to remember all these beautiful moments in Penglai and pass them on to you. Lovely, peaceful, passionate, delicious and romantic. All are suitable to describe Penglai. It's a place for vacation and sightseeing, no matter with friends or simply on your own. The land is aerial, but the dreamland in Penglai is within your reach. When you're available, my dear friend, you should come to Penglai to enjoy a carefree life like the immortals and find your long lost self. <laughs>